Hey guys, SkateDogs27 here. Welcome back to another coding video. Today's coding video is going to be on how to use item meta to set custom display names and custom lures and uh, all that fun stuff. So the first thing we have to do is we have to create our boolean, our command boolean. Fun, I know. Command sender, sender, com command, command, string, command, label string array of arguments return this as true and import both of those remember you can do quick imports by using alt enter now what we can say is we have to create our commands so command dot get name equals ignore case super sword so for the item meta, we're going to be creating a super sword, which is going to be a diamond sword with the display name of super sword and a custom lore. So what we're going to do um, to to do that is we have to get the item first. So let's create an item stack called um, sword, and let's make and we need to make a diamond sword, right? Because I mean. Diamond swords are just about the only super swords available, or I don't know. I'm just making stuff up now. So diamond sword, and now what we can say is we have to get the meta. So item meta, meta equals um sword dot get item meta. Now what we can do with this meta. Is we can change the meta display name. So let's say meta dot set display name chat color dot aqua plus a uh, quote plus chat color dot bold plus super sword. Now the reason why I put those little quotes there is because two chat colors next to each other with the pluses will actually cancel each other out. So the bold will actually cancel out aqua, so aqua will not show. So what I have to do is I have to put two quotes there so it basically runs no message. So it confuses the code and then it can combine aqua and bold together. So next what we can do is we can say meta dot set lore arrays dot as list chat color dot um blue plus um, this sword is awesome. So what we did was we got the arrays as list and then we made it a blue lore that says this sword is awesome. So now I'll just go ahead and return that. And then we can say, oh, uh, we have to create our player first. So player player equals player sender import player and now we can say um player dot add or get inventory dot add item and then we can say sword but before we do this we have to say sword dot set item meta to meta so what this is doing is it setting all this meta to the sword's item meta and then it's giving the player the sword with the item meta on it so let's go ahead here and create a new artifact and build on make remove the extracted craft bucket Tyler desktop test server plugins apply okay do it let it do its thing phone just buzzed here we go up on the server and job is done so now if we type actually crap 
I always, every time I do a tutorial, I forget this. Commands. Super sword. Usage is slash command and description obtain the super sword now let's try this we can reload super sword and as you can see it gives us a super sword that says this sword is awesome and it has the nice blue lettering so this is how to create um, items using custom item meta to create custom items in like kit plugins or mini games that you might need this for. I'm SkateDog27. If you guys enjoyed this video tutorial, don't forget to subscribe, like, favorite, comment. Comment if you have any issues with your code. Please put your code in a paste bin form and I'll check it out and respond to you as soon as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm SkateDog27 and I'll see you guys in the next video.